When it comes to buying the right products, there's a lot to look out for. That's why today, we've picked and reviewed the five best models for you. We've spent many hours researching these products, and we've ranked them by many different factors, such as price, quality, durability, performance, and more. You can see their prices and find out more information about these products by using the links in the description down below. To make it easier, we will include timestamps there in the description. Let's not waste any more time and get started with the video. Before we jump into the best gaming mouse pads, first I want to talk about a few things that you should look at before buying one. Material. First, you should make sure that the material you're choosing fits your needs perfectly. Nowadays, mouse pads are available in four types of material, plastic with rubber bottoms, cloth, glass and aluminium. In my opinion, the cloth pads deliver the best experience because they're made of soft foam and fabric and also they can be easily rolled up. However, this type of mouse pad has a disadvantage because you may have to replace them every six months as the edges get damaged and they're a bit hard to clean. Edge. Just as the surface, the edge of the mouse pad is important too. You should also know that after some time, the edge will begin to fray as the surface and base begin to detach. Usually, this kind of issue often happens when you buy a cheap quality mouse pad. That's why you should make sure to purchase a well-designed and durable mouse pad. Base. The base is often the most overlooked component because this can make or break a mouse pad. The base comes in different thicknesses. You have to choose the right thickness for you because it can play a big role in your gaming experience. The slim base, 2mm, is perfect for those that want a more solid feel. The standard base, 3mm, is perfect for those that want a mouse pad that's not too thin but not too thick either. And finally, the heavy base, 5mm, is a base for those who prefer a more comfortable feel because on this base the surface is much softer. Design. As you may know, mouse pads come in various sizes and shapes. You must know that a good mouse pad can enhance your experience. The size is an important factor because if you play games at low sensitivity, you may need a larger one. If you don't, you might want to stick to the standard size. However, you should just make sure to find the one that you like. Without further ado, let's take a look at our top five picks. Number five, Steel Series QCK. One of the best mouse pad manufacturers in the market is the Steel Series Company. The QCK is a large size gaming mouse pad that has high quality, great design, and overall it feels very smooth and comfortable. It's designed to have a non slip rubber base that won't let the pad slide on the surface, which is amazing. It's one of the most amazing mouse pads on the market without a doubt. The best thing about it is that it's not only for gaming, but you can also use it in your office without a problem. When it comes to design, the first thing I noticed was that it was heavy and thick, but it felt so comfortable and smooth. Overall, the design is pretty simple and plain. Something else you should know is that it has a very solid build quality, which means that it's built to last. This mouse pad provides a fluid movement to the mouse and is a good option for those that don't want a table-sized mouse pad. Something else that's great about this one is that it's perfectly suitable for LAN events due to its thickness. Furthermore, this mouse pad has many more great advantages like the large surface area, the great grip to avoid flopping, and it also is pretty easy to clean. It has a rubber base to make it stick to the surface that it's placed on, however this one is not finished with stitched edges and that makes it look less premium. Also, the edges may start fraying a bit, but it still does a pretty good job. I should also mention that if you decide to wash it, it will take a while to completely dry off. To conclude, I'd say that Steel Series has done a pretty good job with this one, and I'd highly recommend the QCK to anyone who's looking for a mouse pad that's built like a tank and that offers a very smooth gliding experience. Number 4. Logitech G640 the Logitech G640 is designed for gamers who play with low DPI mice because it provides a soft fabric surface with moderate friction and a clean, consistent texture. The rubber base prevents the mouse pad from slipping. It has a flexible cloth construction that allows you to roll up the mouse pad and take it with you wherever you go. It features a surface heat treated at 392 degrees Fahrenheit to provide just the right amount of friction for low DPI gaming maneuvers. When it comes to design, I must say this one is built to last. It's very durable, has a very smooth and comfortable gliding experience, and whether using an optical or laser mouse, the G640 gives gamers access to enhanced sensor accuracy and precision. 
The G640 uses a surface texture comparable to the optimal testing environment for Logitech G mice. Furthermore, the feel of the powder is very smooth, but with enough texture for control. All tests that were done on this mouse pad found it to be consistent from edge to edge, and no changes in surface feel or mouse drag. It's one of the best gaming mouse pads on the market. Furthermore, you should know that the rubber base is firmly bonded to the cloth and keeps the flexible surface in place and prevents the cloth from bunching up in front of the mouse. When comparing it to other models, this has a tighter weave on the surface and more of a shine. Something else I like about this mouse pad is that it can be very easily transported, thanks to the flexible cloth construction. The G640 rolls up for easy transport and lays flat when you're ready to play. It's a great gaming mouse pad, and Logitech states that this was made to work best with the Logitech G mice, but it works great with every other mouse without a doubt. Number 3. HyperX Fury S One of the best large gaming mouse and keyboard pads in the market is the HyperX Fury S. This one is very popular among professionals and enthusiasts alike that can deliver you amazing gaming experiences. It has a nice design for a desk-sized mouse pad, and it's large enough to accommodate your keyboard too. It has a pretty good textured base, which does a great job of keeping the pad in place. It has nice stitched edges, and it's finished with a HyperX logo on the bottom right-hand corner of the pad, which looks pretty cool. Something else that caught my eye was that the backing is made of some strangely textured rubber that does the job pretty well. It sticks amazingly to the table, thanks to the interesting pattern. Also, the build quality is amazing on this one, and there's nothing negative about it. Because it doesn't have any uneven parts to it, even the edge stitching is perfect on this one. It has an amazing performance, and it won't slip in any way when playing long gaming sessions. This is amazing. It features a micro-waven cloth surface and a heavy rubber base material. It has a medium-fast and consistent glide, and the glide stays smooth for months. It does everything right if you're looking for a consistent gaming mouse pad with a medium glide. As you may know, no mouse pad is perfect for everyone because everybody has their preferences, but when it comes to this mouse pad, I can freely say that this one doesn't have big disadvantages whatsoever, and if you want a large and good performing mouse pad, you should check the HyperX Fury S out and see if this is the one you were looking for. Number 2. Cooler Master MP510 Another great gaming mouse pad is the Cooler Master MP510. This is one of the most popular when it comes to those made of Cordura fabric. The mouse pads come in three different sizes and they're all splash resistant, they feature a logo that glows in the dark and they also have stitched edges. The Cooler Master MP510 is one of the best in the market and you should give it a look. The first thing you'll notice if you purchase this one is that the pad will need a little bit of time to lay out flat to be usable. This means you should let it lay out overnight without any added weight, and it'll be perfect. It has an amazing build quality, and it'll last you for years. The reason for that is that it's made of Cordura, a highly durable nylon fabric. The backing of the pad is made out of regular textured rubber that tends to stick to the tabletop better. It has an amazing performance, and none of the other pads in the market have a similar weaving to the Cooler Master MP510, thanks to its unique surface type and material. It doesn't have disadvantages whatsoever. Everything is stellar with no uneven areas and no bumpiness. This unique soft mouse pad with a nice surface made of Cordura is one of the best in the market. It has a nice design, great build quality, and the performance is just top notch. It's nearly flawless, and if you want one of the best, make sure to check this one out, because it surely won't let you down. And at number one, it's the Zowie GSR. The Zowie GSR is one of the best gaming mouse pads in the market without a doubt. It's a lot wider than it is high, so the GSR is more rectangular than some other mouse pads out there. When it comes to design, this one is not very thick, which means that if you're playing on a massively uneven surface, you might encounter some issues. However, it still is thick enough to cover up small imperfections on the playing surface. It looks great, and it has a very solid build quality. Moving on to performance, first you should know that the materials and the finishing on this one are very high-end, which impact directly in gameplay and give you a better experience during gaming. It's designed for all types of gamers. If you play on low sensitivity, this mousepad controls your sensitivity very nicely. Something else that I should mention is that many professional CSGO players are using this mousepad because it provides excellent quality and performance. Furthermore, this one has an amazing amount of stopping power, which means that if you tend to overshoot targets or want to get a bit more control, you should definitely check out the GSR. 
When it comes to the glide, even though the GSR feels pretty controlling, it has to be said that it glides smoothly everywhere. The only thing that might be considered as a disadvantage is that this one tends to lose its initial feeling a bit quicker when compared to other high-end pads. You should know that after one or two months of usage, you may need to wash it because of the sweat and the accumulated dust. To sum up, I would say that this one was designed to offer you amazing gaming experiences, and you should definitely check it out. Thanks for watching. I hope you liked the video. If you found it helpful, please remember to leave a like and subscribe to my channel to see more videos like this in the future. If you have any questions related to these products, you can leave a comment below and I'll get back to you as soon as I can.